Hello folks, Jason Crispin here of JC's Bees. It's January 22nd and uh, the weather is just extremely crazy. Um, normally this time of year we would be in the mid 30s, probably have some snow on the ground and uh, the bees would be within the hive occasionally getting a break to come out. Well as you can see the sun's blaring um, it's 63 degrees and it's been this way for four or five days. The bees are out flying and I've actually witnessed them in my chicken uh, run stealing some laying mesh to supplement some pollen. They'll use them to raise a little bit of brood. Today I want to discuss something with you that you're going to come across if you have more than one hive. And that is putting some form of identification on the hive so that you can tell one from the other. My first few years as a beekeeper, what I would do is just simply take a paint marker and put a number on them. That worked fine until I came across one day when I was doing an inspection and I noticed the box wasn't in the greatest shape, so I swapped it out with another one. When I closed the hive back up and turned around all proud of myself and realized, ah, I don't have the number on the hive anymore. I just removed the, the box with the number on it. So that got me thinking, well, I need something where I can just remove the numbers as the boxes need swapped or as they're being used, uh, something a little bit more versatile. One day I was moving the cattle. We practiced something called intensive grazing where I moved the cattle every single day. And uh, one day I was standing out in the pasture looking across the field and a cow was looking back at me and it hit me. Cattle tags. You can pick up a bag of these tags at Tractor Supply, TSC, Royal King. Uh, most of your livestock stores carry them. Um, I have about $16 in this bag, and it's got tags 26 through 50 in this bag. You can see it's labeled right here. Um, so if you wanted to start with number one, you may have to uh, be a little bit more picky and do a little bit more searching. But for me... Starting with number one wasn't a big deal. What I've done here is I've taken uh, these little screw in hooks. You can see here, I just screw them into the box and then the cattle tag sits right down on there. Now, if you're not very familiar with cattle tags, this little black piece here, it pushes into the end of the tag. It's a hard piece of plastic. The tag itself is a soft, pliable rubber, as you can see. So when I push it down over this, when it gets to that corner, it kind of locks on. So I haven't really worried about the wind blowing them off. And if that was a problem, all I have to do is bend this back a little bit more, or they make much bigger hooks. But this has worked really, really well. I'm able to take my notes and... Uh, Put down the corresponding number for each hive, and it's it's helped me keep my notes a lot, lot more straighter. Cattle tags are removable. They're reusable. They're water resistant, and they're the perfect method to mark my beehives. Why didn't I think of this sooner? So thanks for watching. JC's Bees. I hope the video has been uh, informative to you. If you like the video, give me a thumbs up. It'd be appreciated. If you have any questions or comments, leave them below. And hey, if you haven't subscribed, please take time to do so.